should go tell that. Just wanted to spin back at you. There's a hole in the side of the uh, pulley here. If you can see it, right in here. Basically, all you're going to do is feed your rope through it. You can go either which way you want. You get it through there. Tie your knot. You don't want a very big knot in here because it can get bound up in the starter pulley. But you get that on there. Make sure you got it good and tight. Run this end here through your starter handle. Tie you a little bit bigger knot on this one. So it doesn't pull through your handle here. Once you get that on there, make sure it's good and tight and won't come undone. And here's the critical part is setting the tension on the spring. You don't want to over tighten it. If you over tighten it, you'll end up bending or breaking the spring. And you just wind this up. Some of them actually have cutouts for this. This one doesn't. Let me get it wound up there and then check it to see how far it pulls it in. And it pulls it all the way in there. When you pull it out, you want to make sure you pull it to the end of the rope. You see where it's there instead of the end of the spring. If you're too tight, you'll pull to the end of the spring and you'll break it. Um, you want it to where it's just pulling the rope in, maybe one wrap more. Let's see here. See that one there is kind of kind of limp. So you can go one more on that and you should be good. Come visit us at LonnieQ.com.